Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. And your forecast this evening, we'll see those temperatures remain in the 70s, even at 11 o'clock, only down to about 73 degrees under clear skies. A reason the temperatures won't drop off quickly tonight, the winds are going to stay up a bit. They won't be as strong as they were during the day, but still a little bit on the breezy side overnight. Winds pick up again during the day tomorrow, 69 at 8 o'clock, 78 degrees at noon, and 82 at 5 o'clock. Looks like we'll be up around 83 for that high tomorrow. Record high low temperatures are going to be likely today. Uh, we've only been down to 65 degrees. Is our record low high temperature, or record high low temperature, let me say it right, is uh, 64 degrees. So it looks like we're not going to drop below that by midnight. So that'll probably be a new record for us. 63 and 44, the normals there. Unseasonably warm again on Tuesday with cooler weather on the way for later this week. Our low temperatures tonight only expected to dip down to 68 uh, for the overnight low with those winds staying up. So a very warm night on the way with that forecast low of 68. Our record high low temperature tomorrow, 64. 5 degrees, 1947. So there's a good chance that record is going to go uh, by the wayside for Tuesday, too. Our forecast highs, though, not quite getting up to the record highs in the afternoon. 86 our record high today. Same number for tomorrow. We're expecting about 83 degrees, but 84 in Cincinnati. Still, though, an unseasonably warm day. Anytime you're getting into late October and still hitting over 80, that's pretty good. Uh, usually by the end of the month, that doesn't happen at all. Uh, no threat at all on the severe weather index next 24. Four hours with the windy warm conditions in place and still dry. Looking at clear skies tonight on the Duncan Oil Company camera over in Springfield. And even though we had a few fair weather cumulus clouds around now, you can see those pretty much thinned out. Some jet contrails uh, drifting in tonight. A little bit of high cloudiness, but still overnight expecting mostly clear skies. It's dry on live Doppler 2 HD. Uh, the rain, you have to go all the way to the northwest to find it up across the Great Lakes. Showers, thunderstorms there along a cold front. Windy warm conditions. Today, wind gusts over 40 miles per hour in Chicago. We'll see that cold front dropping southward, though, start to increase our chances of rain later this week. Right now, 79 in Dayton. We have a south wind 17 miles per hour. And the relative humidity, 52%. Our weather check readings tonight, upper 70s, lower end of the 80s, up in the Bradford area. Scott Biesecker at 82 degrees. Gary Rust in Camden, 82. Bill Telsero looking at 79 degrees tonight. Our future track forecast keeping us mostly clear. As we head through the nighttime hours, it looks like tomorrow we'll start to see a few more scattered clouds move back into the area. Should be a mostly sunny start, but then back to partly cloudy skies. There's even a chance for a couple of showers as we head toward tomorrow evening and tomorrow night as that cold front starts to drop in from the north. So it looks like Wednesday not as warm as tomorrow, but still above normal temperatures. Our forecast tonight, clear skies. It'll be mild, breezy too with that south-southwest wind only down to about 68. Partly sunny tomorrow afternoon. Windy and warm with a high up to 83 degrees. Should see some sunshine in the morning, but then those clouds start to move in up into the low to mid 80s in the afternoon. 83 at 4 o'clock, 80 at 6 p.m. Wednesday's high backing off to 76, a chance of showers. But then Wednesday night and Thursday, rain becomes more likely. Cooler, 66, could even be a rumble of thunder on Thursday. And then much cooler by the end of the week. Highs backing off into the 50s there for Friday and Saturday. So fall will find us again by the end of the well, week. I noticed, 83 and then 38. You flip the digits and <laughs> here we go. And we're just going down about 10 each day there. Yeah, that's All right. the way it works.